Greetings, programs. This is Wretch, and welcome back to another day of Minecraft. Now, in today's episode, I think we're going to get a little decorative. And what I mean by that is I think the Great Hall needs a chandelier, or at least one of those low-hanging uh, candle holders. I think would look really, really good in here. And I have a ton of dark oak here. I've got 40 pieces of dark oak that we're going to turn into planks. At least a good portion of it. And then we are going to see what exactly we can do to play around with getting this great haul done. Because I think it is about time. So, let's get some fences going. And we're going to do... Well... Do we need dark oak for that? Let's see. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I think dark oak would look good. So, let's start with 15 right now. Just to see. And the spot that I have layered out is right about here. So, let's head up here to the roof. And I'm thinking maybe... three because I thought about putting glowstone in the problem with glowstone is you know they wouldn't have any kind of those artificial lighting sources so they would just have to deal with torches and don't worry I'm gonna make this a little bit more uh, fancy than what it orig initially looks like promise but putting those right there look good and that's when it starts bugging me that this stairway is actually four but so is this uh well yeah so is this way so i'm just gonna have to deal with that nothing that really i can do about it so we're gonna put this one down like so well not like that so and hmm Once, yeah, I think that might work. We're going to need just a little bit more fence. Nothing too extravagant. Now, if I put torches up on each side, actually, I think that would look kind of cool. So let's do one more little thing of torches. Or a uh, fence, rather. Two, three. Just, just to be safe. Give us a little bit of surplus. And then I'm going to make some plank, or uh, I'm going to make some more sticks. I've got 41 wool right now. I know I've got plenty of item frames. Also, I wanted to show you guys this as I go off on a tangent. I went ahead and got rid of that little curvature to these doors and put in double doors because this is the defensive position. I'm going to put some sets of iron armor here to be the guards kind of thing. And you may wonder, though, that this was uneven before. This is actually open this part. Well, I took some uh, stone brick and actually filled in this area so it's even when you come through and here. And I also did this on every bit of stairway and I also added the doors to the living quarters. So I did get a bit done off camera. So how much more are we needing? We just needing, we're just needing that one, aren't we? I believe so. So let's get up here, lay down some torches, while the dogs look on inquisitively, and see if I can do all of this without having to go elsewhere. Indeed. So, let's see how that looks. Hmm. I think it might be missing something. Let's... Can we put in... Ah, there we go. Now it has that support frame. Eep, not that one, though. Ah. Uh, go away. Jump and chop. Oh, right there. There we go. That looks a little bit more 
in tune with what I was wanting. Okay, so we have our chandelier. Now it's the dark wood. I don't... Part of me is wondering if I should make it out of the same... Out of the brick. Out of the nether brick. Instead of the dark oak. I don't know. We'll see what happens when we finish the rest of this. Now, I've got some spruce wood stairs, but I want dark oak. I don't know why I had the spruce. Oh, I had the spruce. That was um, residual from the stuff that we were doing way back when in the uh, Adobe house. I just had it in the chest, I think, or something. Now, we're going to make tables. A long table here and a long table here, I think, is what we're going to do. Or we could just do long communal tables. No. Let, let's just, let's play around here. Hello there, zombie. I hear you. Causing all kinds of ruckus. But you can't get in anymore, can you? No, you can't. So we will do, ah, go away, torch, like so, and if we were going to make this, let's say our, the dais pretty much ends around here, just to give me a guide. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, it's going to be an eight by do I want it to be by two though do I want to do an eight an eight by two or an eight by three let's see what that looks like because most of my aesthetic for this is that scene of coming down the the hall you know and seeing all of this in its glory so and that's also another thing we need to be paying attention to is in correlation with the fireplace so what I think I might do I don't want to put the chair right there well maybe let's see and then I'm gonna get some wool carpet and cover the 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 tables to look you know a little bit I like that a bit better yeah we're gonna do the the three long tables with the chairs well hmm well maybe we could do two let's try that because the uh, the reasoning I'm saying that is I kind of want a walkway Maybe a three wide walkway up to the front in case anyone hadn't has an audience with the Lord of the Manor. So we put the chair there. And then we use that. We're gonna have to get a different color chair too. So let's just say for the sake of reference though. But that's the chair and then it'd be one two three yeah that is it that is what it needs to look like so let's chop all these down and reposition them and maybe some hmm I don't know let's let's play around with this first before I get too ahead of myself three four and I wanted like so we did it eight wasn't it it was one two three four five six seven hey doggy move thank you like so so that's a long table this is going to be another long table it looks a bit meh right now but we will see now I might turn this into a corner area because the thing is that people are gonna be coming in like 
serving food and such. So we're going to have a little bit of extra space over here, aren't we? Hmm. With the tables, that's going to give us a one, two, three, a three block area. Hmm. Well, let's, let's finish this. Keep on thinking steps ahead and that's not exactly the best thing you can do. Let's get some more dark oak planks so we can make some stairs. And I never use shift for the most part, guys. And I'm trying to teach myself how to use shift in terms of distributing resources. So just bear with me if you can. And one, two, three, four, five, six, okay. And then basically have a carpet heading straight. Oh, that's gonna be bad though because of how the stairway is. That's what's bugging me is it's in relation to the stairway. Hmm. Well, I think I have the, I think I have the medicine for that. We're going to get rid of this and I'm just going to have a gap to have a big chair. I'm guessing. And we had the chairs going down like so, which means oh. I am just messing up all kinds of things today. There we go. There we not go. Do you even Minecraft wretch? Not really, but I do the best I can. That's got to count for something, right? Two, three. All right. Now, is this dark oak? Okay, it was slightly off color. I thought I was building stuff with spruce and I was gonna cry. Now, we're gonna do that and with these corners, one of them will do, and we got six. Stick this one, like so. Good, 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 good. Now let's do this over on this side. Ah, now it's coming together. Now it's all starting to make sense. I said make sense. <laughs> Whoop! There we go. And my low on food, it's okay. I slaughtered some chickens earlier before I started recording. I have a ton of sheep, guys. Holy crap. And you know what's going to bug me now? I'll give you a guess what's going to bug me. Because I'm going to fix the dais. The chandelier is off-center. So I'm going to uh, have to rebuild that or reset everything. Basically, I'm going to have to make it a, uh, a two-wide chandelier. I don't know how that's going to look. But I guess we'll see. Well, wait, 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 wait. Once, yeah, with the four, we're gonna have to. I'm have to call my shot and stick with it. Odd numbers and even numbers, man. Cannot, cannot escape them. There we are. And these guys are gonna have the warmest seat in the house, but. Nothing too bad. Now, let's see how that looks. See, that looks that looks better. And with the tables all along, this will be a very suitable great hall, I think. With room here for the people to walk around and serve folk. Yeah, as long as we don't put any... As, we, as long as we put, like, like so... Like every other, actually, that'll work out. Four. Hmm. Have to space that a little bit better. But regardless, still looks good. So let's get rid of these stairs because we're going to use different color wood, I'm thinking. Possibly. And let's see what we can do to fix our chandelier problem. 
So if we're going to go for two, we're going to need more fence. And do 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 do. Ah. Well, crap. Wait a minute. We're running low on sticks too. We're running low on all the things. There, fifty will do it. And if fifty won't do it, I quit. And do 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 do. Yeah, we'll just split those up. Nineteen. That should do. Put us right up here so we can build the way. So we'll take out that one and we'll go. Well, I don't think that's going to look too bad. It's definitely going to look bigger. Um, actually, we may be able just to keep that. One, two. No, we're going to have to make it wide as well. Because I want this smack dab in the middle. All right. So I'll tell you what we're going to do. We are going to actually just take this entire thing down and build slightly from scratch. Except for that right there. I've been getting into a, a creature of the night state of mind lately. And what I mean by that is I've been watching videos of... Um, different interpretations of Dracula. You know when you're on YouTube and you're just like, hey, I'm going to look up a random thing. And you're there looking up stuff. It's like Wikipedia. And you end up looking for stuff for hours and hours and hours. Same kind of premise. I actually might have to make this fireplace double. Or uh, a four. Hmm. No, because then I'd have to redo all that stuff, and that's just, ugh, that'd be a nightmare. So, one, two, three, one, two, three. So, let's get rid of that torch. We'll just put that torch there, because we don't want anything suddenly spawning and making our day unpleasant. Alright, so, one, two, three, four... Are we on that the right spot? Yes, we're at the halfway point, so the other one would go one above me. Which I think we may already have that set up. Let me double check just to make sure. Maybe? Yep. Awesome. Good. Exactly like I planned it. Yeah. <laughs> um, now, the question is, how is this thing going to be built? Maybe we have this as the supporting strut. And put that there. I think with, with being a little bit thicker, this could actually work without any of the diagonals, I think. We'll put the torches on and see how it looks. Yeah, I think that could potentially, potentially be viable. So let's shed some, shed some light on the situation. One, two. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's convenient. And can we shift around? Do one more. There we are. All right. Now let's get rid of our little makeshift platform. I might want to make this a little bit more intricate but I want to see what it looks like when you turn the corner. All right. So you come in, you turn the corner and hmm, maybe 
Well, one thing that we could play around with is... Okay, let's try this. Ah, no, not you. That's a little too low to the ground. We'll double up again, at least on, on this level. Okay. I am just sucking today in terms of block placement. Like so. Oh, off um, hats sudden, just because I remembered it. Really excited to hear the news about the P PS um, Plus from PlayStation actually allowing um, subscribers to vote on the free games each month. I think that is an awesome idea. Now, this is also going to be really dependent on the quality of the games, whether this is a good thing or not. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put these right here at the corners and then I may take these out here in the middle and then it looks kind of like a frame hmm ah. so let's put the candles here on these diagonal areas we just added and see if maybe that gives it a little bit of of zest of what I'm looking for. Definitely gonna look a little bit more intricate. But the stuff I've seen on the PS Plus, um, at least for PS4 users, I haven't paid attention a whole lot to the other systems because I don't have them. But yeah, looking really good so far. I've, en I've enjoyed the games that I've gotten. Hmm. I don't know. Look around here just one more time. What does it look like when we delete these? It just looks a little too blocky for my taste. Ah, okay. I see what we can do. Okay, now these are floating here in the ether. And that just looks all kinds of weird. But maybe if we... Hmm. Yeah, like so. Basically make kind of look like they alternate, maybe. So there's like so many things you can potentially do. We might just do that. But let me let me see if this is actually looking ill. not don't I don't think it's passing mustard as the uh, or muster I don't know if it's muster or mustard I've heard it multiple ways I think because one side got it wrong one game I think that they really should consider adding to the uh, the PlayStation Plus because they've started to put in a few uh, PS3 games that you can play at any time and, that, and that's gold you know that's that's good the PS3 from what people have told me it was a good system and I used to watch my friend Lance play Metal Gear Solid 4 on it all the time and well actually with all that that rigging no longer there. I think it might work out some. Let's just go ahead and stick with that for right now. And if I want to change it, I can. That's the great thing about it. Now, if we're going to do a dais here. Now, the thing is that making this all four kind of messed this up. So, what I'll do is I'll head over here and I think... In the block, is that where I put them? Yes, that's where I put them. Got 64 blocks. This is similar to what I did to that little hallway here. Let's delete that. And we will actually... Yep. There we are. Now everything is right in its proper place. Except for that little curvature which we could easily take care of, but it's all right. We'll find something to do with these corners. 
but putting it all on here on an even kilter I think works now I'm gonna check and see if this dark oak I actually thought about doing this section with quartz but I'm not sure because they also get a table hi table not high not, that's not me saying hi to a table but the actual high table where like the nobles or the lord of the the lord of the manor would keep himself and then well that would be kind of cool we could put banners along here let's let me check something here let's go one at no wrong way Need to set this like so two three four and then if you put a cool looking throne or something right along here like a, a four wide chair that would kind of look cool it actually kind of looks like a judge's station that look kind of sick but you could put the banners along here on the front and when you walk in you know whose castle this is and putting banners up there I don't know a lot to a lot to think about but if they get some PS2 games on the PlayStation Plus or that the PlayStation on demand I forgot what it's called right off the top of my head I would love that because there's one game I've wanted to do on the channel for a long time and just to be quite blunt I tried to emulate it and it just did not work out well so I think I'm gonna have to wait until we can actually play it legit oh I forgot to mention this too I also hollowed out this area I'm gonna try I'm gonna experiment in here to see what the Lord's room would actually look like but as you can see there are doors I kinda want, want it more open than kinda of stuffy but we'll see but I think we've got a lot of work today. Um, the game that I'm looking forward to is Rogue Galaxy, which was an awesome RPG that came out near the end of the PS2's run. Um, space pirates and galactic swords and all kinds of stuff. It's like Treasure Planet meets Star Wars meets anime. Look it up when you have a time. It's a really awesome game. And the second that becomes available for general play, I am there, guys. You will definitely see a Let's Play of it. Let's climb up here to the tower. I've got everything lit up too, if you can already notice. So everything's looking pretty, pretty good. But we got the chandelier done. That was more productive than I thought it was going to be. So I'll go ahead and end it here. Hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you liked the episode, go ahead and click like down below. Subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment. That'd be a big help. And we'll see you next time. Later days, everyone.